Hey there, it's Elizabeth, and welcome back to another Ramble Session. So, yes, I hope y'all are doing well. I hope you had a fabulous weekend. Uh, we had a very nice weekend until about, I don't know, 5 a.m. this morning. <laughs> when my husband came in and woke me up and said, Babe, you might have to take me to the hospital. We need to get home. Yeah, we went down south this weekend and, um, you know, I mean, my husband was feeling pretty rough. As most of you know, if you've been following along, um, yeah, he's got some pretty heavy health issues going on and has had them for a number of years. Anyway, long story short, good news is, fingers crossed, we've averted yet another ER visit. I'm really hoping that's the case. Um, so yeah, any prayers, thoughts, good wishes would be appreciated. And so now we are home early and I don't even know what time it is. Is it even seven o'clock? I'm not even sure. Okay. Um, now, as most of you know too, I work now mostly like almost full time, might as well be full time, honestly. And so I film these on Sunday for you guys and then air them on Monday. So um, yeah, if you like what you see, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the notification bell. And uh, yeah, so you can be notified the next video uh, I make comes out, which is generally now, because I'm working uh, outside the home, is about three days a week. Sometimes I throw in a bonus video here or there. So thank you so much for your support. And thank you for those that are supportive and leave such very sweet comments. Um, on another note, if you don't like what you see, feel free to put a thumbs down. Um, some of you have chosen to put some, uh, you know, negative comments and that's okay. I've got fairly thick skin, but um, you know what, just as you all have the freedom to put whatever comment you want, just letting you know I have the freedom to delete it. So yeah, um, that's all I'm going to say about that. So let's get started. Let's get into what's been going on. Okay, so this is my September-October book, um, and I am, you know, working on things, okay? This is probably the last thing I worked on was the Joey Pocket. I will put the link below. It's a fabulous pocket. Um, I did work on this page here, and this was actually the 13th, and what are we on now? We're on the 20th. I am seven full days behind, okay? <laughs> yeah. Work, let me tell you, is kicking my butt. But I am so thrilled to say that last week I actually did have a nice week. Like, things are finally smoothing out. Um, yeah, I'm very, very happy about that. So that that's wonderful. This is my July and August book, which I am still finishing. Yes, and I'm hoping because I've been up so stinking early... I'm going to be able to work in this today and get it done so I can finish out the flip throughs for you. Um, let's see what else, what else, what else? Um, oh yeah, this weekend, here's my my Jesus Calling book. This I read from this today and it, it was actually talking about like, um, uh, you know, like kind of like don't sweat the small stuff, you know, like don't waste your energy on the smaller stuff because when the bigger stuff comes, you'll have all that energy um, instead of wasting it all on the smaller stuff, which I did find myself doing over the weekend when I got a few negative comments that I needed to delete. Um, yeah, that to me, that is small stuff. My husband having to be, you know, possibly in the emergency room, that's the bigger stuff, okay? People that just went through Sally and have lost power and homes and belongings, you know, that's the big stuff, you know? Yeah, not people that just uh, are negative just to just for negative sake, you know? I don't, I don't understand it myself. You know, I was always taught, thank goodness for my sweet mother, who's been gone eight years now. You know, if you ain't got nothing uh, nice to say, just don't say anything at all, you know? That's all there is to it, you know? Um, and then my daughter, she got some, she had ordered a bathing suit from Real Sirens. Isn't that a cute, like, little logo sticker? She gave me her, her sticker. It's called Real, as in, like, a fishing reel. Sirens, I, you know, you know what a siren is. 
Um, and so, yeah, so they're so cute. And so she um, gave me the tags and whatnot off of them, which is super fun. And the, this is their business card. So, you know, if you, there it is. If you're interested in um, handmade custom swimsuits, uh, by all means, go to their website. She happens to really enjoy them. Um, they are fabulous. They appear to be wonderfully made. Um, and bonus, they are reversible, you know? So it's really like getting two suits in one. And this is the super cute bag that it comes in. So I use that in my journaling or I send it out in Happy Mail. So that's fun little tidbit uh, for me to put in my books. So here we have, oh, let me get this out of the way. Let me get that out of the way. I don't even know what that is. Okay, yeah, I do know what it is. All right, and let me see about this magazine here. Um, I'm just taking addresses off. Um, so at any rate, yeah, I hope I hope you all had a nice weekend. I I did have a nice weekend with my husband, of course, you know, because why? Well, I was with my husband, and that's always great. Um, and. You know, he was feeling puny and whatnot. However, oh, I got a happy meal too that I would like to go through. Um, yeah, he was feeling rather puny, but we did, we were able to go out and about on um, Saturday. He just didn't have the energy to go boating. It was actually a beautiful boating day, but yeah, poor baby, he didn't have the energy. So he came home after we came home from going out and about and doing our thing, hitting our normal haunts, um, which, in which case, yeah, I found some stuff at Dollar Tree. I did not find anything except an, a file cabinet for my daughter. Um, I'll go through this in a minute. Uh, at Salvation Army, I didn't really have all that much time to, you know, go through all of the, um, whatchamacallits, all of the books and everything. And then where else did we stop off? Oh, we just stopped off at Publix to get food and stuff. And then, oh, and then we had a very nice breakfast together. Yes, at our one of our favorite places, Evelyn's. So that was really nice. Um, it was hot as Hades, I can tell you that. And then when we got home, he actually slept most of the rest of the day. He just really needed to catch up on sleep. And so that was good that he was able to... Um, you know, get some much needed rest. And then I, most of the day, let me tell you what, I watched the very exciting auction on Rosemary Morris's channel. It was Shannon Green uh, having an auction, her very first auction, and it was super duper fun to watch. And um, all of her stuff sold. I'm pretty sure all of her stuff sold. She had some wonderful, wonderful items, handmade, um, you know, journals, painty journals, kits, just all kinds of stuff. It was so, so much fun. And I spent, it lasted about six and a half hours and I spent most of that time watching it. Yeah, it was a lot of fun. Another live that I watched, which was going on, um, when was that going on? Friday night was the sweet Shelly and Ann Lar. Okay, Shelly from Crafting Mamas. Oh my goodness, I just love her to bits. Okay, I just love her to bits. And um, yes, and Ann Lar. And Ann Lar is just super hilarious, and she's so fun to watch. And I'll put I'll put all the links below. Blah, blah, blah all of the links below like I always do um, please go over there and check them out and um, Shelly from Crafting Mamas also has a Facebook group if you're interested in that so I'll put that down below yeah so that was a super fun you know live to watch it they just had me in stitches okay poor Shelly was choking she was laughing so hard <laughs> it was just a lot of fun and just a nice way to just wind down from the day Okay, so yeah, those were my, my YouTube adventures over the weekend. So let's see what I got at the Dollar Tree. Okay, yesterday we went there. I always stop off at the one down south because um, they just seem to have more stuff than ours at home. So I got these super fabulous sticky notes because um, I use sticky notes a lot at work. Um, like a lot. So these are super cute. Oh, and you know what else I saw on YouTube? Speaking of sticky notes, was Laura 
got her uh, got a really sweet happy mail from um, the most adorable uh, Nicole at Relax Cut Glue, and she shared it. And um, if you remember, I don't know if you remember if you saw that. Yeah, I showed this video. Look what Nicole made me a button, right? And it says Never Hopeless by Elizabeth. And this is my avatar. Okay, now some of you, and it's a button. Aren't they adorable? Oh my gosh, thank you so much again. And so she had made some for Laura as well. And it says um, the Jersey Crafter on it with a rainbow because Laura loves rainbows. And then it says Meet Me in the Bubble. Oh my gosh, how adorable. I love meeting Laura in the bubble, let me tell you what. But some of you had asked me if this is me, okay? No, no, that is not me. It's some actress, I can't remember what her name is. But um, this is actually one of my very first collage, um, like collage uh, crafts, you know, that I did. It's in a very large, I think it's in a large, um, file folder, like handmade file folder book. I don't know. Let me see. I think it might be right here. Let me just chuck. I'm right here. Yep. Here it is. That is the original. And that is what I took my avatar from. Okay. And this was, um, I made this in 2004. I'm sorry, 2014. Yep. 2014. And I absolutely loved it. I was super into Packard Eye, still into Packard Eye. Um, love her work, her collage work. So yeah, that that's the story behind my avatar. It's just always been my avatar. So I've never, you know, I've never wanted to change it because I've had my YouTube channel for so long now that, you know, you begin to recognize people's avatars. And so I don't want to change anything up. There's just no point. So back to the Dollar Tree. Yeah, so I got these really fun things. Then I got this super cute um, paper pad. Look at that. Pink and it says, you go girl. I mean, how adorable is that, right? With a little unicorn on it up there at the top. So adorable. Loved it. You know, I can't pass up a good notepad. And then this one, live life in full bloom. I love flowers. So cute. And then I picked this up because I wasn't sure if my husband needed a pocket calendar, uh, a two-year pocket calendar, but he actually has a two-year pocket calendar until the end of 2021. So I guess I'll just use this one in my purse or whatever. Picked up this super cute sloth um, uh, washi tape, and I have an idea I'm going to give this to someone very special. So that goes in there. And then I also picked up these envelopes. Now, let me just see here. The reason I picked these up, <clears throat> and I really hope they work. If not, of course, I can use them for something else. But I picked them up because I'm really hoping that my Joey pockets ah, are going to fit in here. Okay? Oh, my word. Okay, perfect. Hopefully, they'll fit in here once they're stuffed, right? With, with stuff, you know, so that I can send these out in happy mail. Hopefully, sometime very soon. So yeah, they fit perfectly. Okay, fabulous, great. All right, so I got three packs of those to um, use. Oh yeah, I have this. Now this here, sorry if there's a glare. Um, this here was, uh, this I got, I saw these at, um, we were, actually at the restaurant right and they have those like you know because we it's a very touristy area so they have these free magazines everywhere and so look at that beautiful sunset picture um and then inside you know well they have maps for one and they have very like this is a gorgeous picture here right um the words, you know, so I just picked up a few of them. Ooh, a big old alligator or a crocodile. No, that's an alligator. That's an alligator. Alligators have flat noses. Crocodiles, I believe, have pointy noses. I don't know. Um, there's the Everglades. At any rate, some maps. You know, oh, there's another picture of, um, yeah, this would be an alligator. They live in the in the, um, 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 in the Everglades. Okay. 
So yeah, just lots of fun pictures and, and maps and stuff like that. So I picked up just a bunch of them because again, I have packets to send out in Happy Mail and I just wanted to put a little bit of, you know, the Florida Keys in their packages. So hopefully I will get to that rather soon. Okay, I also received this right here now, um, which comes from Pullman Chamber and Visitor Center. Okay, this is in Washington State. Yes. So I had sent away four some brochures, right? This is a roadmap of Whitman County, but how beautiful would this be right here if I cut that out for my glue book? And that's what I'm going to be using these for, my glue book. And they are free. Look at that gorgeous map. Sorry if it's super glary. But, I mean, these beautiful pictures, you know, the map itself. I mean, lots of different uses. Look at that gorgeous picture. So, yeah. Pulling dining guide. Oh, that's cute. That would be cute just to use uh, to decorate up. You know what I mean? To put in your... Um, I would probably put it in my book... Uh, glue it on three sides, make it a pocket here, and then make it a flip out here if I had a lot to write about. So that's always fun. And then the scenic byway. Like, look how lovely. Well, I love this right here. I would cut that out. Love this down here. What a beautiful picture. And then look at that picture of Washington. I mean, so beautiful, right? So yeah. And these come free. So you can look up and you can decide what states you want information from or whatever. Um, yeah, you just look up like free tour guides online, honestly. Okay, then I also receive, I'm saving this for last. Um, I also received my town and country. So yes, I can't wait to go. Oh, there was a pug. And that reminds me of, I think that's a pug. <laughs> It reminds me of Shermie right there. That's Nicole's pup. So yeah, lots of fun pictures in here to go through. Beautiful lady. Yes. Nice. Okay. Yeah, I'll have to go through. Oh, look, a Vincent. No, that's a munch. I, it looks almost Vincent Van Gogh-ish. I don't know if you can see that, but yeah. So lots of great images in here. That's cool. Even to cut out, like to fussy cut that white dress, that would be a nice contrast in a glue book. Okay, so yeah, I'll have to go through that one of these days. Okay, then we just got home and sweet Deidre, you're so kind. Ooh, look at that envelope, how fun. Okay, the poor thing, poor Deidre, she had sent me this before and then um, it like got munched up in the mail, okay? So luckily she got it back and then she was able to send it again. So thank you so much. Oh, love you, beautiful lady. Oh, well, you're beautiful too. Thank you so much. Look at all these fun, fun, oh golly, words. Um, perfection is completely overrated, yes. Sneakers, that's going right in my sneaker box. There we go. Don't wanna lose it. Uh, create a life you can't wait to wake up to. Yes, all the, these are just beautiful, thank you. We can do hard things, yes. Yes, story of my life, story of my life. These are beautiful. I've never had much of a social life. I clipped this out as well, that's really funny. A uh, little bed picture there. These are super sweet pictures. Oh, uh, are those foxgloves? I don't know if you guys can see them. I'm not really good at flowers, but a beautiful picture. These are just gorgeous. Little bed pictures. What a what a nice thick magazine too. It looks like it might be from Mantra Wellness. I always love these because if I ever have a video call or something like that, I use these little things. So I always clip them out. Thank you so much. Beach scene. I can, I will, end of story, so positive. Oh, love these little fruit slices. How fun are they? They'll be fun. Oh gosh, lots of, oh, that's adorable. Yeah, lots of different pictures, beaches, beautiful birds and patterns. Thank you so much. Oh, I love that. Yes, nice. Thank you so much. I'm so glad I got this. I haven't even gotten a chance. Oop, there's another hidden, some maybe hidden words. Yes. Start where you are. Use what you have. Do what you can. 
Arthur Ashe. Oh, wow. Yes, that's exactly like I try to say that all the time. Like use, you know, do what you can. I don't know. There's another quote from somebody and I can't remember who it is, but it's like do what you can um, when you can with what you've got, something like that. Maybe it's the same. I don't know. But love it. Non oh my gosh, love it nonetheless. Look at that. Oh, these pockets are adorable. Oh, I'm not gonna go through all of these. I'll go through all of them separately, but oh my gosh. Yeah, I can use a lot of these in my glue book. Oh, these are just fabulous. Fishing, oh yeah. Oh, these are great. I love these circular ones. Thank you so much. And she cut them out for me, which I so, so appreciate. Oh, how cute is that VW bus? <laughs> How fun. Thank you so much. Gorgeous. Gorgeous. These are really cool pockets. Do you have um, a video showing how you made these pockets? Because they are fabulous. Look at that. It appears to be out of a sheet of like one sheet of maybe um, cardstock or like one sheet of scrapbook paper. But how fun is that? And they fit perfectly in one envelope, right? Let me see where her envelope went. Where'd it go? There it is. I just want to see two stamps it took. So not much at all. That's fabulous. Two stamps for all this stuff? Oh, oh, I might have to scrap lift that idea, Deidre. How inspiring. Okay, remember, you get to create your life. Love that. Oh, I love these. These are fabulous. Oh, look at that fussy cut beautiful flowers, citrus. Oh, how fun. Love that. Homebody. Oh my gosh. Yes. Love is a verb. Okay. Love is a verb. It is. It's not a feeling folks. It's an act of your will. Yep. You choose to do it. And it's the same with the opposite of that word. Oh, I remember seeing this in one of my magazines. How funny, a little fishy. A little fishy. Oh, these are fun. Yeah, nice, nice, nice. Thank you so much for all these wonderful. Be kind, work hard, stay humble, smile often, never stop learning. Oh, awesome. That's an awesome little mantra to have, I can tell you that. Oh, I remember this too. Oh, great. I love those silhouettes. And look at this. Oh, the fancy schmancy. Um, yes, I love this one. Oh, I love that. I hope you can see without too much glare. More beds. Fabulous shapes and colors. Love that. Oh, another how are you. Love that. I keep those in a special place. Oh, flamingos. Lovely. And oh, look at those peacocks just beautiful. Thank you. Thank you so much. What a way to come home. We had a rough start to this morning. I can tell you that folks, but what a lovely way to come home. Um, hopefully we will be able to stay home and I won't be taking a trip to the ER. So yeah, again, if you like what you see, don't forget to click that, uh, subscribe button and notification bell. And yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for sharing your time with me. And uh, yeah, while I share what I do with you. So I appreciate it. Have a great rest of your day and a wonderful week. And I'll talk to y'all real soon. Bye for now.